Hi, this is Kara, and I wanted to show you what else I made with the February Love From Lizzie kit. Uh, last month, I made a mini journal like this. Um, I had the supplies left over, and I made just a little mini journal. It had stickers. I did some sewing in the journal. I used papers that I have in my stash and lace that I had. This was in the kit. This card stock was in the kit. <clears throat> this card, or no, this is a sticker from the kit. The die cut was the stag head. So this is what I made last month with the kit. The January kit. I think it turned out pretty cute. And I used a mailing envelope as the cover and some of the wood grain specialty paper that was in the kit and then some of the ribbon on the side and as the closure. So that's what I did last month. This month, it's a birthday theme, so I thought it would be fun to make an envelope flip. And this could be, um, I could send this to a swap partner or I could give this to a crafty friend for their birthday and maybe put a, tuck a gift card in there. Um, but anyway, I had this idea with the leftovers um, for this month's kit. So I used stickers from the sticker book, my own punches, um, the glitter paper, this was the mirror paper, and just kind of made a collage. And then you flip it open I'm bummed. My little dots got a little messed up. I wasn't patient. I should have done this last. <laughs> the peel-offs. I uh, popped it up on some foam tape. <clears throat> and then there's this one. More stickers and different embellishments. I uh, inked the edges with, oh, I put it away, but some oxide. And then it goes this way, and there's this page. This was from the Cut Apart page. My daughter did the coloring on that sticker. I thought it was really cute. And here's another sticker. This one's pretty simple. I think I might go back and add some glossy accents. I think that'd be cute. Or, uh, not glossy accents, but Wink Estella to make that shiny at the bottom. And then here's one of the hearts, my punch, and more of the mirrors. And then on this one, I made a little belly band, and then I made some tags. So this one has one of the diamond paper clips. This one has one of the hearts, simple little tags. Another sticker from the sticker sheet that says happy birthday, and these just tuck right in. And then this is the back. And then inside of these pockets, I have little cut-aparts from the cut-apart sheet. So I put those in here. And just use my Tim Holtz Tiny Attacher on a little envelope. So those are in there. <clears throat> And this one, I had another one, and I used my punches and punched out some of the paper. This one, I left blank, uh, or empty, I mean. So this is where the gift card could go. And then this last one, I just have the cut aparts so that the person that receives it could use the cut parts. So there is my little envelope flip. Cute little friend mail or snail mail, birthday gift, pretty cute, uh, I thought. And then this is all that I have left in my kit. I have, whoops, you know what? I think this goes right here. I don't know where my circle went. <laughs> so I have some of this cool paper. I haven't used this. I love this paper. I'm going to probably end up making another card. 
a card panel, another card panel. So all I need is to grab some um, white or colored cardstock from my stash and I could use up these bits. Lots of stickers left from the sticker book. Some more pieces. I threw away the smaller pieces. Lots of peel-offs left. Another piece of cardstock. More of the stickers. Of course, the stamp set. Oh man, I need to clean house a little bit. <laughs> More of this. Cut out the happy birthday. Um, some more cutouts uh, from the paper. Uh, another diamond. Lots of ribbon left. Punched circle. Well, oh, oh, not the sticky note. More of the cut aparts. And I have more of the chalkboard paper. The gold, the golding, the flakes, the die cuts, and Nouveau drops. And there's a couple cut aparts in there. Or, uh, punched pieces in there. So that's what I have left. I feel like I did a good job. <laughs> if I do say so myself, using up the February kit. I think it feels good when you know that you've used, oh, and the sequence, the majority of a kit. Um, sense of accomplishment, if you will. Well, that's all for now. Thanks for stopping by. Um, have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching. Bye.